Hi everyone, welcome back to Diamond Paints with Mike and today we are going to be doing the second coaster. I've had a bit of a change, I don't want to name them all beginning with B and so this one is going to be called Finley the Hummingbird. So yeah, um, so what we'll do is we'll start off like we did before with the, um, the number one drills and work our way around the board. I found my white pen today which is this one I'm working with. Um, I haven't used that for a while, so it was quite nice to, um, I lost it and found it today because weekends are sort of like my housework day where I do like a big declutter and stuff <laughs> and also tidy up and things. So it was very, very nice to have found it and I was like, oh my God, I lost that pen, you know? Um, I'm still waiting for my, the time is 16.37, and earlier on I was filming the cow bag, and I'm still waiting for Amazon to deliver the package, um, because it's supposed to be moving right soon, and it's now going to sort of like backlog everything, so, um, they used to always deliver by like one o'clock and now it's come pear shape so got to keep waiting and waiting and waiting and it's just really unfair um and they say like to leave feedback you know and will improve the surface but they don't so obviously i wanted to start dinner soon um because i've been having some really late night dinners at like nine ten o'clock because i've just been so busy and some nights I've just really didn't want nothing, but I know I've got to sort of eat, so I don't know why there's a gap there, but so I really want to try and get dinner done by seven. Well, I start it at seven, but hopefully by half seven forty-five it should be done, you know. So yeah, I've not had to open up a new bag yet because I think they provided us with three of these bags of silver so uh, it's uh, quite nice to still be using some I reckon it's probably like four per coaster probably um, but I never refill up my trays unless I've used them all first so I've been reading up a bit more about these headaches and apparently um, tension headaches can last like longer than a normal headache but apparently um, let me see if I can find it So apparently, hang on, why does sleeping the fan on? I have found something else, um, uh, Roxanne. So apparently it says sleeping with a fan on can cause headaches because the circulating air can dry out your nose, mouth, uh, mouth and throat which can lead to mucus overproduction. This excess mucus can flow into your sinuses, blocking them and causing headaches. So that could be what it is. Um, but I didn't know your mouth was open when you sleep. I mean, I don't, I normally keep my mouth shut. So, um, I mean, sometimes when you snore, the reason why that snoring happens is because your nose and mouth it's because your mouth's open when you're breathing in, so it's like, you know, it makes that noise. If you were snoring, if your mouth was shut, it wouldn't do it, you know? So, just trying to really sort of pinpoint what's causing it, and I've had it for like the last, I've had it nearly every day so far, and it's getting rather ridiculous now. I'm getting really fed up with it. Um, and I have a little gadget that I bought on Timu. It's like a uh, it's like a, a, a clip thing that you put over your palm to sort of like um, get rid of it. It's like a clip pressure thing. And 
I lost it the other day and then found it. Um, so I've been wearing that and it's not really budged it. Like, I have headaches where, like, they'll go and then some, like, just linger, like, all day, no matter how many things you try and do, have a cup of water, um, you know, have medication, it just will not budge. So, I had a line today, because obviously I'm filming this on Saturday, which I'm not really supposed to. Oh, lovely, that's what we want. Just had me thing pop up to say that my parcel's ready for collection. Lovely, see, 17, nearly five o'clock. It's always the way in it when I sit down. <laughs> sit down, I thought I'd just sit down because I won't be here yet. And yeah, so that'll be where I'm off to next. So fantastic. Um, and then I've been playing the game because I'm trying to get up to, I play this game and then what happens is when you play the, if you, ha it only works on, um, you know, uh, iPhones, uh, not iPhones, sorry, Android. But I've been playing this game and what you do is you play the game, it's called Just Play. And I get like, I put the, um, the oh, what do you call them, the gift vouchers onto here. And I've got £1.04 and I want to try and get that to £1.50 if I can because there's something come after. So yeah, you just have to like keep playing and playing. I've always found that I get about a pound a day. But that's, you know, better than nothing. You're getting your money's worth with Prime. Because I'm a Prime member, so I pay literally like um, £8.99 a month for unlimited next day delivery. So I probably get stuff going there every day with that voucher thing. But it's, it's just so nice because it's like you're working and getting something out of it at the same time. So, yeah, I can find quite a lot of stuff for a pound on there. And I'll order, like, even a bag of sweets. Even stuff that I really don't need, I'll just order just to get, like, it used up and stuff. Because um, there was one occasion where I did it, and a few days later it got took off. And apparently, when I contacted Amazon, they said it was a technical problem. So, just been watching Debbie Gets Crafty's um, food haul with Todd and yeah they've got some lovely stuff so uh been catching up with that and I watched my uh kit up video back because let me know in the comments like if you are a YouTuber like myself let me know do you watch your own videos back because for me I like to watch it back as like a viewer's perspective as well because when I'm filming it I don't see what you see until I filmed it because by the next day, I forgot what I've talked about. <laughs> so it's just nice to like, I'll have it on in the background on the TV and then just sit on the sofa, like playing the just play game. And then just seeing it come to sort of life and that. So, yeah. Sorry, I just need to do something. I'll be back in a minute. Sorry about that. Just had to uh, quickly refill my cup because it's... Um, I would normally have the fans on in here, but now I've seen that it can cause headaches because my fans are on from like 7 in the morning right the way around till, you know, 7 again in the m next morning. But obviously the only time I turn them off is when I'm work and stuff because i'm using my like, energy i don't need to use and yeah it's sort of thinking now like is that what's causing it i just don't understand it i, I take medication it goes and then it comes back again so clearly something's not right but because i'm so busy next week i've got an appointment with well one of the appointments is this annual health check thing or whatever they call it. It's where you sort of like get your measurement done, um, check your abdomen and stuff like that. And I think it's just pointless really, but something that I really don't want to do really. Um, but it's got to be done apparently. 
I don't think it's mandatory. I think you can like choose, but seeing as they've texted me saying it's due, I might as well just go and do it. And then Monday I'm at the dentist. Well, that's on, um, can't remember when that appointment is. I'm gonna have to look on the system. Um, and then Monday I've got to go to the dentist to pick up my brushes. So, yeah. Uh, I've got to go out in the baking heat. Do you know, by the time I get back, like, I need to change shirts because I am, like, drenched <laughs> in um, sweat and stuff. I thought so. Let me just back that one up. It's not going in there. Nice try, but it's not going to work. <laughs> this drill was so shiny, it was trying to be there. But as you can see, they've printed that back to front. Because if you turn that upside down, you can see that the shiny bit is there, look. So the, I keep getting a lot of these back to front things. So I'm not sure why that keeps happening. But I like to always do the edge and then work on the centre, like the focus point on these. And Lazy Retired Granny, thank you for letting me know that you like the trim i do as well i think that's my favorite bit on this such a lovely design so i'm trying to get all these done by the end of august but it's going to be a bit of a mix and match so let's talk about the schedule monday you've got the pink birds then tuesday is the next reveal which actually is the parcel that i'm going to pick up in a minute um, and I've actually thought about it. It's actually, you actually get in basically an unboxing and a whip and chat at the same time. Because I probably will do the unboxing. I'll show you the reveal and then you'll see the unboxing another time, you know. So, a bit back to front, but it is what it is. Um, but I just had to get this thing, so I don't want to say any more until, you know, I get, um, show you guys. Because... It's something that one of the other YouTubers I watch had, and I just had to have it. I think it's similar. I don't think it's exactly the same one, but it's a bit similar. So, yeah, that's good. So I can go up. What's the time now? 12 minutes. So I've got plenty of time. But after that, I can go up, get them, bring them home, and then start dinner, and then hopefully sit down and watch me film. <laughs> So, give it another hour or so, it should start to cool down. What is the, Alexa, what's the temperature today? Alexa, what's the temperature today? At the moment, it's 22 degrees Celsius. Tonight, you can expect a low of 11 degrees. But, um, one thing for sure is I've got to get some medication because... It is not budging, so I'm going to have to pick some up in the store. And knowing me, I'll go in. I have got Yodel to drop off as well, but knowing me, I'll go in, drop that off and forget about it. So <laughs> normally, 10 times out of 10, every time I go up to that locker, I've got a vintage customer as well. So, But some of the payment got released today for customers, so that was good. Um, and then I just sort of reinvest it back into... Done paint really. Um it really all helps as uh, Tesco say. <laughs> What's the one that slaps their jeans? Is it as to price? They go as to price. <laughs> oh dear me. So yeah, it don't take long to um fill up the border, which is quite nice. But yeah, ten times out of ten, every time I go there, I've got Yodel, so I tend to drop the odor off first because obviously I need room in the bag to put the parcels in. It's just easier to go in there first, sort that out, and then I'm done with the shop. And I literally come out the shop, go out the door, and it's like literally around the corner. So about a two minute walk. <laughs> and then you've, they've, uh, there never used to be an impost locker up there. And they've, where the Amazon locker's here, the impost locker's like round here like round there somewhere so problem is more and more people using lockers these days it's just so convenient you know because um i know that 
you know, I don't have to rush about, you know, in case they've left it on the doorstep and stuff. I know it's, you know, in a secure location. And, um, some sweets are calling my name, I tell you. It's, because it, I know it's there, I just want to go and get it, but I'm halfway through doing this. And I'm not stopping just to go and get a poxy parcel, you know, I'm, I want to commit to doing this first. And then after this, I'm doing a bit of the Cardinal because what I've decided to do, I've got, a, I've, something happened on Friday and I couldn't go. So I've now got to go Monday instead. So I'll go to the dentist first, pick up the brushes, then pick up any parcels that I need to get from my mum's, aka my office. <laughs> and... Uh, <sighs> Bloody heat won't go away. I'm a bit fed up today, I don't know why, but <laughs> it's probably the weather it has a knock on effect, isn't it? But oh, 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 lovely. We've got a little bit of uh, sparkle there. Look at that. Isn't that noise? Right, so I have now accommodated three trays, as you can see. So I've got three new trays here. So what we'll do is we'll get out bag 17 if we can find it so we've got 13 19 8 oh could I have that bag that's a cow bag I've got some yeah so 17's over here lovely so we'll get out this gorgeous pink I love this pink so vibrant isn't it it's like a hot pink yeah, this is by far going to be pretty. I can't show you the other one um, because number one, it's already been finished. And number two, it's in the seal up pile in the front room and I'm in the bedroom. So, um, yeah, that'll have to wait. Looks like a like a grape, doesn't it? <laughs> you need one like right in the middle there, like that. I can get it off. I don't understand why they leave gaps. So annoying. I do apologise if it sounds like I'm moan all the time, but I'm a very like says it how it is sort of person. So if I think it looks crap, I'm gonna say it looks crap. <laughs> but yeah, I really hope we get um some of them spare because they're quite good for like upcycling projects. Oh look. Forgot the ring round. We'll do that another time, no problem. Right, let's go for number six. If we've got number six, which I do believe we had last night, didn't we? Yeah. So this is, no, that's number five. Number six is just around the back of my cup, which is this lovely dark green. It's gorgeous. What I'll do is I'll kit that one up, actually. Um, because these trays, I've been working on the cow bag and that's finished now. So um, I've, that's where the trays have come from. So I can use that coaster, birds, and then we'll put number six. So that's that, lovely. And then we'll get rid of that plastic then. Okay, right, so number six a bit of my drink it's gonna be quite a pretty one this the green and pink go so lovely together don't they really really nice Okay, so that's that. And then what we'll do is we'll kit up, um, so we want coaster, bird, and then we'll do number five, because we've got one tray left after this. So let's get number five up. Yep. I so need to dedicate like a storage box for these special drills, like that's super cool. 
These are so sparkly and I love them. So yeah, Roxanne, hopefully we can see you doing these because uh, I know you said you absolutely love these. So um, I checked the other day, I think I checked yesterday, yeah, and they're still selling out of stock. So um, I'm hoping they'll come back in fairly quickly and then you guys can buy them if you're into sort of like hummingbirds and stuff. Fold that back. Can't resist. There we go. Right, so I'm going to save the last tray for number four. See, as soon as they become dormant, they're back kitted up again. Yeah, if I don't go to the range next week, um, uh, sorry, champs of next week, I won't have any stickers left. Because <laughs> um, unfortunately, the shop over, oh, look, you idiot. I've just kit done that and I've already got it kitted up. Okay, so that one will be 13 then. But yeah, um, our shop over here, they do do the stickers that I like, which are these ones here, but... Every time I go in there, they're near enough sold out, whereas Champs have seemed to do a much more, um, like, better stock at getting them up. Like, every time I go in the branch one, it's like one or two on the shelf. But Champs has always, like, seven, ten packs on there, so I try to double up as much as I can, you know. But it is... Oh, it's horrible without stickers because you like you can't get up properly and sometimes i have to like cut out little pieces of paper just as like something to use as a sticker so what we'll do is we'll do 19 next so bird and that's 19 and that's all my tray is going to get until something becomes dormant i mean the cow bags um there's a few more trays for the cows so i might be able to sort them out 19 is and what's nice as well is i get to use free up bags what the penguins wing for the bolt for swimming rather than flying what you're talking about and small didn't even ask about a bird allow them to propel themselves powerfully oh my god seriously making them formidable underwater predators but i didn't ask anything about a bird <laughs> This is quite a nice colour, isn't it? Though purple isn't my favourite, it's uh, okay, I suppose. Do you know, every coaster I'm doing, I just think is bigger and better than the last one. This is so pretty. So what we'll do now is we'll just do a bit of this ring work going around here. Um, and then we can get some of that uh, put in. So we'll do the four first. She's like this sort of lime greeny colour here. So that's that, and then we have is that the seven color here? So I'll do the seven next. I need a bit more of my drink. 
tell you what, I've never drank so much in uh, August, but it's this horrible weather. I'm much more of a cold person. I don't like um, the heat. So, I'm not sure where that's come from, but it might be a 17. so funny because Nanny McPhee and the Big Bang's on TV every like weekend they put films on and uh, I was like I was watching the first one that last week <laughs> so what we'll do now is we'll work on a little bit of the bottom get some of that kitted up 18 bloody hell we got an 18 that must be one that's still in the pack. I don't recall doing an 18 before. Wow. I don't know what that's doing there, that shouldn't be there either. You know, I try so hard on the weekends not to do any painting, but just so used to like doing some every day. So yeah, it's hard to resist the urge. So this one's like a little Christmas bell, isn't it? Sort of like, you know, like them gold bell bells you can get. Do you know the one the Christmas song I like? Um, is the the one that goes um, something like, "Hark the bells, sweet silver bells, all seem to say, throck as a way, ding dong, ding dong. That is the song Christmas is here, bring it with cheer." Um, cover those the bells apparently And tomorrow it's roast dinner again. But next week I'm having toad in the hole. So I want to break. I've had like three roast dinners because I normally buy the five pound birds. So, but they are. Uh, I've had like roast dinner every week so far. So I fancy a break. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm not 
happy with that one. Some of these you have to watch out for because they can get, like for example, that looks a bit dull. Whereas if I was to pick up one like that, it's more sort of shiny. So you sort of have to like watch out for these ones. Something under that. Oh my god, look, we've got bloody jewel stuff on this. Oh dear. So, yeah, we're flying through these. Do you know, I keep thinking I, I'm going to start dinner in a minute, but I've got to go to that bloody locker. So, because I used to send them to mine, and ever since. They said that they delivered my aerial with the chocolate um, when they never, and they lied. I don't send it there anymore. I don't send it here anymore because you can never know if they're going to deliver it, if they're not going to deliver it. So it's best they just go to the locker. I do get fed up and keep walking up the hill, but it takes it out of me. Like, I'm a... F I'm a um, big lad, so it does sort of like wear me out sort of thing. So we'll bring that round a bit more on this. Nearly done the bathroom, so that's got to be... Just got to mop the floors and then that will be done. I haven't done hoovering yet, so I'll have to do that later as well. It's just not enough time. I tried to split it over the two days, but I just think if I get it all done, I don't have to do it tomorrow, you know. So, yeah. Okay, so let's put another seven there because I've got a seven just here popped up. Yeah, lovely. Okay. So we'll bring this round a bit more now. I've just found out there's a shop in the town centre where Tesco's is that does Amazon pickups. So that's an option um, and it's in a shop that I've never ever tried before and I've lived here for like since 2015 so yeah always surprises me you know you live in the town and you you find shops that you've never ever been in before is this shop that it's at, I, you know, it, I have no reason to go in there, so it's not really a shop I have ever used, but if it saves going up that poxy hill, because we do have another one called Chapek, and that's right over the depot side, but I find it, like, longer, because you have to go right past Lakes Industrial Estate, and then, like, round the U-Bend up a bit more, and, yeah, it's a little bit on the long side, that one. It's like in the car park, so outside the shop, so it's always busy with cars coming in. So there's one time I got a parcel sent to sunglasses, which is the locker over here, and it said we can't deliver your item because we can't access the locker. And I'm thinking, well, how can you not access it? Well, it turns out the co-op decided it was a great idea to put bike racks in front of it. So you've literally got this much of a gap, and if you can't get there. You know, all he could have done was like move the bike out of the way because it, it obviously if the bike's chained up, you just move it around the back wheel round and then get it in and then move it back again. You know, but they don't think to do that. So
All right, so I'm gonna leave that session here today. I'm sorry it's a short one, but I need a wee wee. I can't be bothered to pause the cam camera again. And also, I have got, the time is now half past five. I've got to go up the locker, get that thing. And I need to go before I sort of like backlog it anymore. I don't really want to start cooking at eight o'clock at night. So anyway, yeah, um, it's uh, looking really, really good and really really looking very very pretty with this one isn't it the colors sort of match around the piping as well so it's beautiful beautiful little lovely coaster here and we'll just give that a little bit of a rollage as you can see and then that is that is that a i thought that was a dull one then but anyway we'll pop the cellophane back on there because a little bit bigger you could actually if you wanted to you know cut that out as a new release paper in circles there's no option um you know there's an option to do that but uh yeah so um thank you for watching thank you for subscribing liking and tapping that good old notification bell and we will see this completed in the next session so until then have a lovely day we'll see you next time bye